Hi, this is Tyler, and this is part of a series where I cover every drug in RimWorld, their usage, and profit. Today we are snorting Yayo. Yayo is the rich man's flake. While still a poor choice to consume, it lasts longer and has better benefits. Unfortunately, it is less addictive, which is bad for business. Let's see if a runny nose all day is worth it. Yayo gives a massive 35 mood boost, 80% recreation, 50% pain suppression, and 66% reduction in rest needs. The best benefit here is plus 15% movement speed, which allows for easy kiting of targets. These effects last half a day. Addiction is significantly less prevalent than crack. There is no addiction threshold, but each hit only has a 1% chance of addiction. In times of desperation, those are odds I would take. Long-term kidney damage can occur if you have a tolerance. Withdrawal as expected is living hell. If someone gets addicted, let them die an honorable death in battle while coked up. Rehab will take 30 days and they are guaranteed to constantly break during this time. So how much money will becoming a Mexican drug cartel make us? It takes 6 work and 8 psychoid leaves to make. With a market value of 21, it has a net profit of 5.8 silver per dime bag and 0.97 silver per work. It weighs 0.05 kilograms for 420 silver per kilogram. So, is coke worth it? For usage, surprisingly, sometimes yes. Never give it to anyone that is essential, but if you might lose your colony to a raid, it can keep your soldiers fighting until they have no limbs left. It's only a flesh wound anyways. For profit, it depends. It's worse profit per work than flake, but you process less leaves at once with flake. If your leaves are going off on you, then coke is better because it uses up leaves faster than flake. But if you have no problem with psychoid leaves deteriorating, then flake is the way to go. Yayo also has a higher silver per kilogram, but both of them weigh so little that this will rarely matter. Thanks for watching. Next episode we cover Go Juice. Hope to see you there.